or something? Okay. The whales have a 15-foot penis. Hold on a sec. I just National want to... National Pornographic says it. I'm sorry, Ken. You, you cut out there. They have a 15 what? The whales have a 15-foot penis. I didn't cut out. You heard me. Google it yourself. The whales have a 15-foot penis. I'm sorry, Ken. You, you cut out there. They have a 15 what? Are you a pervert or something? Okay. The whales have a 15-foot penis. I'm sorry, Ken. You, you cut out there. They have a 15 what? The whales have a 15 foot penis. I didn't cut out. You heard me. Google it yourself. The whales have a 15 foot penis. I'm sorry, Ken. You, you cut out there. They have a 15 what? Are you a pervert or something? Okay. The whales have a 15 foot penis. Okay, hold on one sec. I just want to. says it. I'm sorry, Ken. You, you cut out there. They have a 15 what? The whales have a 15 foot penis. I didn't cut out. You heard me. Google it yourself. The whales have a 15 foot penis. I'm sorry, Ken. You, you cut out there. They have a 15 what? Are you a pervert or something? Okay. The whales have a 15 foot penis. What's up, heathens? <clears throat> Let's see. Uh, I haven't I haven't opened up and used my gaming setup here uh, in a few weeks, so you're gonna have to uh, bear with me uh, one second, because <clears throat> I do have to remember to try to get. <laughs> I, I have to remember to try to uh, add uh the game appropriately to my game sounds and stuff so that y'all can hear it um but here we go we're launching the game the i am jesus christ game once we get started i'll switch to a a better uh view here play way play it your way Oh shit. <laughs> Sorry. It just totally fucked with. Uh, uh PC symbols. Like I can't see what the Oh, there it is over there now. Hold on. I think I added the game appropriately. Hold on, let me let me see if I can check my task manager. Uh I am I am Jesus Christ. What is this? It's the name of the, the task what Okay. <clears throat> Keeper core. Why is it saying that doesn't sound right? Level one sounds right. Okay, maybe. Let's see. Let's see how how that does for us. Shit. Got to get everything set up. How y'all doing? Ten a.m. on a Saturday. This is the kind of uh, live stream y'all can expect to have from me. <laughs> All right. 
apparently it's going to fuck up like my resolution and everything. So I may not be able to see y'all's comments here in a second. It is, it's fucking loud. Every time a chat pops up, it like has to reset my entire visual. Shit, okay. Jesus Christ, this is loud even for me. Fuck. Settings. Let's go settings real quick. Audio. Can turn. Okay, I don't know if that really helped me out uh, at all. Let's see. <clears throat> Welcome to I Am Jesus Christ Prologue. Prologue version doesn't represent the final look of the game. Well, I should hope fucking not. You may experience bugs, glitches, errors, and frame rate dips. This is to be expected as the game is still in development. We want to hear from you what you like and not in this game. Your voice as a player matters the most for us. We start listening to people, you know. Hold on, let me switch here. <laughs> Y'all can see. <laughs> um, <clears throat> for that reason, please leave us a comment on our forum dedicated to this alpha demo version. At the moment, we request that only feedback on gameplay features and bug reports are reported to us, as optimization will come further in development. Thank you for being with us and being patient. We will do our best that the quality you demand will come over time during the development process. Meanwhile, we are wishing you good luck and a great time during playing. I am Jesus Christ. Well, shit, I can't wait for it neither. Look at Jesus looking off into the distance. I'm gonna be crucified there. Six settings, gameplay, video. Oh, what the hell is this resolution? Like, y'all seeing the 80, 81, 92, 43, 20? Like, what the fuck? What do we got here? Oh. Oh, okay. Now here's a windowed version. At least now all my chat shit isn't all fucked up. Seems a window windowed borderless. I don't know why it shrinks it down when the resolution's so high. That's what my actual screen resolution is. Quality high, FPS 60, V-Sync is off because fuck uh, uh, V-Sync. Motion blur is off cause, because fuck motion blur. Okay, I think this is probably going to be the best. This will be the best situation. <clears throat> okay, audio. Uh, it's at 30, the master volume. Now it's at 50. I can't really tell a big old, big ass difference. Let's see. Uh, I've already added the game to the wish list. I definitely want to play this fucking game. Is there any way that we could like turn the fucking volume down or some shit? Like that would be like the music volume. Like I want the voices to still come through, but like this music shit's just terrible. Um, where's the dinosaurs? I have no fucking idea. Maybe they're just not part of this particular view, but maybe we'll get some dinosaurs here later. Which mode would you like to play? Gameplay mode is recommended for people familiar with video games. While the story mode is reckon, recommended for people new to video games. <laughs> so they put a mode in here for people that don't play video games so that they can play video games or at least just get the story of Jesus. <laughs> I was in the settings there, Sage. Ohio like I was in the settings and there was no like like there's a master volume knob but I can't like turn individual audio sources down in here ok 
Okay, we're gonna go gameplay. <laughs> Chapter one, John one one. In the beginning was the Word, and the Word was with God, and the Word was God. Bird, 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 yeah. <laughs> yeah, I noticed the crown of thorns loading icon. I can't wait to see that doing some loading shit. Okay. Mmm. Coffee. So, <clears throat> this really needs a narrator for one. If I, because I was totally expecting a narrator to come over and be like, John 1 1, in the beginning was the word. But they, what they really need is Procephus to come in and do this shit. <laughs> in the beginning was the oh, word. There you go. And the word was with God. And the word was God. He was with God in the beginning. Through him all things were made. Without him, nothing was made that has been made. In him was life. And that life was the light of all mankind. The light shines in the darkness. And the darkness has not overcome it. The word became flesh. <coughs> made his dwelling among us. An angel of the Lord appeared and said, Joseph, son of David, do not be afraid to take Mary home as your wife. Because what is conceived in her is from the Holy Spirit. She will give birth to a son, and you are to give him the name Jesus. Because he will save people from their sins. And she gave birth to her firstborn, a son. She wrapped him in cloths and placed him in a manger, because there was no guest room available for them. And there were shepherds living out in the fields nearby, keeping watch over their flocks at night. An angel of the Lord appeared to them and said to them, Do not be afraid. I bring you good news that will cause great joy for all the people. Today in the town of David, a savior has been born to you. He is the Messiah, the Lord. This will be a sign to you. You will find a baby wrapped in cloths and lying in a manger. So they hurried off and found Mary and Joseph and the baby, who was lying in the manger. When they had seen him, they spread the word concerning what had been told them about this child. And all who heard it were amazed at what the shepherds said to them. <laughs> so... I feel like I thought that the, like, I don't know where the prologue is going to stop us here, but it just seems weird. Like, cause so far it's fast forward us through like uh, a whole bunch of the Bible and they've mixed up different, uh, uh verses from the gospels They're mi they're harmonizing the different gospel accounts. And, uh, it's, it's really weird to see it like sort of all mesh together, you know, uh, like that. Um, it, it'll always be weird, uh, for me, um, to see it like that, but, um, just seeing like, like seeing the voiceover over the pre-rendered cutscenes there, I don't like, I feel like, I feel like a, a good video game would have like actually had the scenes play instead of like a, a voiceover that was narrating these like pre-rendered scenes like you just have the scenes play out 30 years later
Jesus. The fuck are you doing? Get up, Jesus. Your time has come at last, O oh, beloved child of God Almighty. You must seek a man by the name of John the Baptist. He resides in the neighboring area, doing many baptisms daily. He shall serve as the starting point of your new journey to breathe hope, life, and a new birth to the world and to man. You alone are the hope of the world. A soul light that must shine in the face of darkness. Now, please seek out John the Baptist. <clears throat> okay, so it, it automatically popped us up out of our um bath towel on the floor. Um the awakening of Jesus. I should talk to my mother. Mama, where are you? This is pretty. Oh, can we get one of those? Um, oh, what is it called? Uh, f um, uh, fat lights like a fire baked pizza. What, um, Crap, I can't remember what it's called, but it looks like like that looks like something you could cook some pizza in right there. Yeah, I'm noticing some stuttering with the thing. So obviously optimizations are, it, it are still coming. Can I get an apple? Jesus wants an apple. This is the forbidden fruit. <laughs> so Jesus can't get none. <laughs> All right, let's see. Mary's over there, as indicated by the huge exclamation point floating above her head. Mary! Mama! Mama! I woke up and there was a weird woman talking to me. Hey, Mama! Yes, Jesus? I have been awoken by an angel in a dream or just stare at her with the stupid look on your face. Okay. <laughs> yes, Jesus. So there's really, there's really only one option here: either stare at her with the stupid look on your face because you just woke up, or I have been awoken by an angel. Oh, I get to narrate this. Oh, that's awesome, bro! Come on, bro, Cephas. <clears throat> I have been awoken by an angel in a dream. I have been told that it is my time and I must begin my life's purpose by searching out by searching out for John the Baptist. Hmm. We have also been visited by angels throughout our lives. I do truly believe that your time has come, my son. I have heard of John the Baptist as well. All right, this is bullshit right here, okay? Because three of the gospels uh, have like Jesus's family, his mother considering him crazy. So like for her to be, I wonder if that's going to maybe play in the fuller game, but I wonder if maybe that's what it's going to be like. Like she's, she right here. She's like, Oh, we've been visited by angels before. And then later she's like, Jesus, are you fucking crazy? What are you doing? You, you dumb fuck. <laughs> Do you know where I could find him, Mom? I was at the market the other day and I heard a vendor at a fruit stand discussing with his friend regarding John the Baptist. It would be best to begin your search there. I totally believe people talked exactly ro like like a robot. Like, I, it, right it, in the first century Judea, everybody talked like a robot. <laughs> Like, I feel like this is very deadpan delivery of these, uh, of these lines. Not that I could do better, but if you're making a game, maybe you should do better. I'll go ask around, mama. Okay, now I gotta head into the market and ask around concerning John the Baptist's whereabouts. Here's my question. 
why is <laughs> why is the spacing between lines like two two to three times what it should be? Like, do y'all notice that? Like, look at it. It's like that's not three separate bullet points. That's one task, <laughs> but it's broken up. Like, it's it's just there's way too much space there. Okay, so apparently that's where the town is. Yeah. I mean, I I just got you some flowers this month. They're dead now. Oh, they're dead now. <laughs> who's the Who's this guy? Ah, shit. Yeah, that you could definitely tell the frame rate drops or like. Look at this. This This isn't smooth. Okay. Uh, are you daddy? Hello, Jesus. It's daddy. Hello, Jesus. I'm a head into the market. <laughs> I'll head into the market to look for someone who knows John the Baptist so I can join his cult and be a crazy cult person there, Daddy. You gonna let me do it? I see. Be careful, please. <laughs> I would not. If, if it were my son, I would sit there and be like, Son, don't do this. This is crazy. You gotta go feed the chickens. Go fucking feed the chickens, and then we gotta milk the cows, or build a table, whatever the fuck. <clears throat> I'll be careful, and God will protect me. Okay. There's an inn. We live next to an inn that they they turned me away thirty years ago, and so we just stuck around. Who are you? Yes. Yeah. yeah uh, do you know anything about John the Baptist? Do you know anything about John the Baptist? Hmm. <clears throat> huh. I recall a vendor speaking about him in the market the other day. Follow me, I'll guide you to him. Thank you. Well, shit. I didn't mean like that. They are very much wanting me to go to the market. I was just gonna. I was gonna, oh, Many oh, people shit. have attempted to write about the things that have taken place among us. Reports of these things were handed down to us. There were people who saw these things for themselves from the beginning. They saw them and then passed the word on. With this in mind, I myself have carefully looked into everything from the beginning. So I also decided to write down an orderly report of exactly what happened. I am doing this for you. I want you to know that the things you have been taught are true. Okay, can we fucking can we, can we get this off the screen? What are you doing? Wait, the where are you taking me? Because like the the icons over there, like why can't I run across the roofs like in Assassin's Creed? I, I'm Jesus. I should be able to float my ass over there. I really didn't need you. Like, I didn't know that you were going to be taking me. Like, I'd have to follow you. So, uh, this is all very unnecessary. What is this guy doing? Just standing in the middle of the road? I mean, I could find my way down to this little town center here. I really didn't need you to bring me there. But, you know, I, w I was just trying to do my due diligence and just, like, talk to people around my house. Be like, hey, Phil, how you doing today? It's like, you want me to take you down to the town center? Well, no, I was just wondering how your family was doing. Well, let me go ahead and take you down to the town center. I don't feel like you're listening to me. Nazareth Market. Oh, shit, I feel like I just opened up a secret. Fuck. Thank you, sir. Okay. Oh, it's this guy that knows about John the Baptist. <clears throat> that, I mean... I do feel like I'm playing PlayStation 2 right now. Why are you staring at me? 
Like, go on. Take your sandals and go back to standing outside your door at the inn. Why is everybody just sort of standing around not doing shit? They're all just awkwardly standing and staring at each other. But there's like ambiance of people working and there's just no, there's nobody that's doing anything. They're all just sort of standing there. Like they're not even walking around this place. I got a lot of notes for this developer right here. <laughs> hey. Hmm? Yes? <clears throat> I've heard a fruit vendor in this market knows John the Baptist. Nothing, thank you. <laughs> Nothing. Uh, no, never mind. I just uh, I'm gonna go back home and like uh, talk to my mama. Hmm? <clears throat> Jesus. I've heard that a fruit vendor in this market knows information concerning John the Baptist. Do you by chance know who he is? And don't make me go Jack Bauer on you and strap your ass to a chair and electrify your nuts in order to get it out of you. Just want to know who he is there, buddy. Hmm. Hmm. Somebody said these quests are the opposite of GTA. <laughs> <clears throat> Villager. Um, well, I don't know John the Baptist, but the other man who runs this fruit stand does. Wait, the other man that runs this fruit? Do you not know who you have a business with, sir? Like, uh, are, are, are you a random person that just collects uh, fruits from, like, wild-grown fruits from out in the wastes and you bring them here to sell? Anyways, um, he lives on the other side of town in a small house. I'm sure you can gather some information from him. Is there anything else you need? <laughs> I like this response. Thank you. <laughs> no, thank you very much. I will seek out your friend. Peace be with you. And also with you. Hey, that could be your slogan later for one of your denominations. Do, 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 do. Uh, Alright, so now the, the thing says head to the southern side of town and consult the man who knows the whereabouts about John the Baptist. Okay. What do you got for sale here? Uh, let's see. You got some uh, orange pile of shit. Uh, you got some other fruits. Uh, some oranges. Apples. You got a banana. Still, everybody is just fucking deadpan, looking each other in the face, not doing anything. Oh, that guy finally left. Like, there's ambiance, but, like, nobody's doing nothing. What the fuck is on her face? Is that a lip ring? Like she's got like one of those like little rings on her face? I... Y'all are just gonna stand there and not say shit. You're just gonna stare at each other. Like you know I want these limes. You best give me these limes. Are these cucumbers? How fucking huge are these carrots? These are fucking massive carrots. Got some peppers, watermelon. It's back up in here. And some pottery. 
There ain't nobody up in here, but all the ambiance is, is out here. Oh, look, some lambs. Yeah, we're going to slaughter that one that's really talkative, right? Or, Sir, why are you staring awkwardly at the livestock? I think maybe you need to move on. This is the most awkward marketplace ever. Yes? Sorry. Peace be with you, and also to you. Okay. comes that motherfucker again he's just running route what are, you, what are you selling are you like a barber you got some denaris there what I really want to know what he sells because it looks like he just sells giving your money away he could be a beggar, I guess. I don't know. Can I run? I can run! Gotta get my ass over here. So this oh, shit. is the beginning of the good news about Jesus the Messiah, the Son of God. Long ago, Isaiah the prophet wrote, I will send my messenger ahead of you. He will prepare your way. A messenger is calling out in the desert. Prepare the way for the Lord. Make straight paths for him. Okay. It's amazing to me that it's not until the later Gospels that we get the whole birth narratives. And they're all bullshit, obviously, because they don't, they, they, you, you can't harmonize them, like, reasonably and rationally. But, you know, Mark, the earliest Gospel starts off with, like, you know, Ah, oh, Jesus was predicted in the Old Testament, so therefore he's real. Can I help you? He's a John follower. I'm looking for the man who knows John the Baptist. <clears throat> Hello. I am looking for the man for John the Baptist, and I'm looking for the man who knows of his whereabouts. Mm. <clears throat> why, why, yes, I do know him. I have been following his activities in the wilderness as of lately, and I have been... Uh, baptized by him. Do you wish to know his whereabouts? Yes, I do. <laughs> so sorry. Hold on. <laughs> the junk shop. The junk shop library says discovered the south side of the town you and your parents lived in for 30 years. <laughs> Yep, yeah, we discovered it. <laughs> All right. Yes, he is the one I am looking for, and I need to locate him. Hmm. Well, then, I certainly hope you are not an enemy of his, as there are a lot of people who want him dead or believe that he is crazy. You can head out of town to the east near the market and continue following down the path and then enter the wooded area which leads to the Jordan River. This is where John the Baptist tends to be around and will do baptisms in this area regularly, usually during the day. Okay, <laughs> there's a lot of directions here. Okay, so you can head out of town to the east near the market and continue following down the path and then enter a wooded area which leads to the Jordan River. 
okay. Thank you very much. Pace be with you. I can promise you that I am no enemy of John the Baptist. I just want him to give me a bath in the Jordan River. It ain't weird, none. How the fuck did I get just get transported? Report to Mary what you've learned about John the Baptist. Father. Why don't you just go to John the Baptist? Why you gotta go back and tell your mama? Wait. Are we still living at an inn? Like, this is an inn, and that's where we're living at. Like, that's, that's the Jesus house right there. It's just molded shit. Mud and dirt. <laughs> Mama, mama, yes, mama. Yes. I know where he is. <clears throat> I've been told where John the Baptist is. He is out in the wilderness that you can reach by following the eastern path out of Nazareth. I'm glad you found his whereabouts. I believe he'd be doing his baptismal in the morning, so you should wait until tomorrow morning to head out there. Go ahead and get some more rest. You seem a bit tired still. What? I mean, I woke up, and it's not like it took me all day to go to the south side of a town that's like a hundred feet wide. Okay, thank you. Get inside the house and take some rest. And take some rest? Get inside the house and take some rest before we journey tomorrow. Seems like a weird way to say it. How do you... Oh, okay. It didn't say E to open up the door, but I guess E is used for everything. Oh, I thought my head got stuck on the door or something. What the fuck is this? Nazareth means a watchtower or a sprout. The latter part of the name likely refers to the hillside that sloped near the town or the hill right behind the town. Modern day Nazareth is nestled in a natural bowl which reaches from 320 meters above sea level to the crest of the hills about 488 meters. Nazareth is about 25 kilometers from the Sea of Galilee and about 9 kilometers west of Mount Tabor. In 2019, its population was 77,445. And nobody knows where Jesus bait his mate. <laughs> <clears throat> Report to your mother before leaving to find John the Baptist. Maybe I woke up in the afternoon yesterday because I'm, you know, a, a 30 year old bum that lives with his parents. This is a really nice, like, clean house, I guess. Were y'all waiting for me? Like, okay. Hey, mama! Yes, Jesus. I'm going to go find John the Baptist and join his culty cult after he gives me a bath in the Jordan. And I, I promise I won't let him touch my junky junk. I am ready to begin the search for John the Baptist. I see. I know it is your time to fulfill your mission, but I will miss you, Jesus. There was a man who stopped by earlier saying that he's a supporter of John the Baptist. I guess word got around that you're going to John the Baptist. He's waiting for you at the exit out of the city. Oh, to lead me in that direction. Maybe I want to find John the Baptist. I will go talk to him, and I will miss you too. Please take care, and peace be with you. I shall return. <laughs> I'll be back. <laughs> the mysterious ally. Wait, could y'all... Y'all are just there. Like, I can't squeeze past you. What are we looking at, guys? It's an open door. This isn't a modern art piece. It's just a fucking open door. Also, Dad, why do you got a hole in your shirt like that? 
that seems to change as you move. All right. <clears throat> so we're starting out before the sun even comes up because by the time we get to the Jordan River, I'm going to need a bath due to all the sweating and the chafing between my legs. And so we start out in the cool of the morning, and by the time that the sun comes up, John the Baptist will be out there giving baths. Can I mantle? I could, I could jump. Can I climb? Oh, shit. I could climb ladders. Booyah. Awesome. Oh, oh. Come on. Let me Assassin's Creed this shit, please. Oh, fuck yeah. Uh huh. Come on. Mantle up. Y'all couldn't have built, like, a mantling system in this? Ah. Okay. <laughs> Chunky junk. <laughs> Let's see. I, I believe I can run. Let's see if I can run and jump. Ah, savior! Boom. No damage. No fall damage. There's no fall damage. How, how about a battle royale, but it's like you choose between Jesus and all of his disciples. <laughs> Ah, everybody wake up. I'm leaving town. Ah, I have infinite run. Ah, boosh. Boom. <laughs> no fall damage. Ah, parkour. Par ha parkour. Judas would win. Yeah. <laughs> I can see Judas winning every time. Fuck it. Judas wins at Battle Royale every single time. It's like he's made a deal or something. Hello, mysterious ally. How are you doing this mor morning? Hello, Jesus. H hi. <laughs> Goodbye. Go fuck yourself. <laughs> <clears throat> I'm headed out to find John the Baptist. Are you the man who has prepared something for me? <clears throat> what have you prepared for me? Yes, I have prepared some food for you for your journey. You'll need it, especially in the heat of the day. Please take a few snacks of mine. I'm a shopkeeper here, and I'm preparing to set up shop for the day, so I thought I'd give you some help before you go to be baptized by John the Baptist. How far away is the fucking Jordan from here? The, the, the guy that I talked to was like, oh, you just go down this path, go through the woods, and then boom, Bob's your uncle. You're there for John the Baptist to, take, to give you a bath. Thank you, and peace be with you, and also with you. <clears throat> Leave Nazareth by following the road out of the market. Ah! Well, shit. I'm not going to... You could at least pop up uh, like a different fact, like another fun fact about first the first century. Also, why isn't my crown of thorns spinning? Like it should, like it's loading. Shouldn't it be spinning or something? Like it, it's spinning, it's spinning, it's spinning. Like it should be spinning. Oh, there it goes a little bit. Oh shit, we're already in chapter two. You can use A and D in order to navigate the menu. Mark 1-1, one, one, the beginning of the good news about Jesus, the Messiah, the Son of God. Those are notes that we collected along the way. And then that's chapter 1, okay. Chapter 2. Like how it's chapter two, but it's Mark one one, right? I am thoroughly unimpressed. Unimpressed with chapter one. The beginning of the good news about Jesus the Messiah, the Son of God. 
John the Baptist appeared in the wilderness, preaching a baptism of repentance for the forgiveness of sins. John wore clothing made of camel's hair with a leather belt around his waist, and he ate locusts and wild honey. The whole Judean countryside and all the people of Jerusalem went out to him. Confessing their sins, they were baptized by him in the Jordan River. And this was his message. I baptize you with water for repentance. But after me comes one who is more powerful than I, whose sandals I am not worthy to carry. He will baptize you with the Holy Spirit and fire. I don't want him to baptize me with fire. That sounds like he's going to set my ass ablaze. Like he, like Jesus is going to baptize me in like gasoline and then light my ass on fire. It's like, you're healed. <laughs> no motherfucker. I'm on fire. Why did I spawn inside of a bush? <laughs> Was this common? Did people sleep in bushes? Like when they were just out traveling around? Like, I don't, I don't understand. <laughs> Um, his friends called him Little John. Scissor. Okay. Sorry, I was going to cut my game sound down just a little bit. Uh, settings. Are there any different settings yet? No. QWERTY. Mouse speed is a 1. Great. <clears throat> Okay, so hold on. Let, let me give you my thoughts so far about this game. I was thoroughly unimpressed with chapter one because all it really was was go here, go there. You know, th there was no like real gameplay element. It, the, I mean, so far I've not entered like any actual gameplay uh, stuff other than me like climbing up on the houses and everything. So far, it's just been a go here, go there, talk to this person, choose the one dialogue option that we have available for you instead of like having multiple options. It's just you've got the one option that progresses things, and then there's the other option where you look dumb. Uh, and so, so far, it's all been story, and I know the story of Jesus. Th this is a mangled story of Jesus. Uh, it's a it's a harmonized version of the Gospels, and so I'm just waiting for some kind of gameplay element. I would I would love some kind of gameplay element. Uh, maybe we'll get some. Press E. You can head straight from here to reach John the Baptist. He is by the Jordan River. Sadly, I can't accompany you since I have to get back to setting up shop in the Nazareth Market. But please take care. You should eat the food I gave you earlier so that you're prepared. You can also pick some berries near the river. That's where we get some of the food we sell. Okay. I could have just found John the Baptist. I didn't need all this exposition here. Do 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 do. Oh shit, now I've got Jesus life. Uh, press I in order to open your inventory. Afterwards, you can use that while hovering over food in order to eat. My inventory is a scroll. That's interesting. Boom! Full Jesus power! What are you doing, bro? Also, why am I so much shorter than you are? Okay, can we get, can we make, can we make this like off the, can we just shoo, shoo that off the screen, please? Oh, apparently, uh, that was not the direction I was supposed to go. Oh, may maybe I need to eat more? Do I need to... 
Oh, okay. I was not at full health. I couldn't tell. Sorry. Oh, there we go. Why is my bar already decreasing? I haven't done anything. Like, it's just existing, like, pain and hurt? I didn't realize this was a survival game. I wouldn't have pegged a Jesus Christ game to be a survival game. <laughs> the point is, is that you don't survive. <laughs> Let me eat some more fucking... Oh, that's the last of my grapes. <laughs> also, it would be nice if the inventory wasn't covered up by my current objective right there. I wish the current objective could, like, just go the fuck away. John spoke to the crowds coming to be baptized by him. Anyone who has extra clothes should share with the one who has none. And anyone who has extra food should do the same. Even tax collectors came to be baptized. Teacher, they asked, what should we do? Don't collect any more than you are required to, John told them. Then some soldiers asked him, and what should we do? John replied, don't force people to give you money. Don't bring false charges against people. Be happy with your pay. The people were waiting. They were expecting something. They were all wondering in their hearts if John might be the Messiah. I am definitely over collecting on the berries right now. Oh, and I have to eat. Okay, let me just stuff my face full of all the berries that I just got. So that that'll go away. Also, I like how... It was a very communist kind of, or not communist, but very liberal message there um, of uh, 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 from John the Baptist of like, if you have extra shit, give it to people that don't have none. And like the Republicans are playing this like, what the fuck kind of liberal shit is this? I did not play Jesus Christ. I am Jesus Christ in order to have a liberal propaganda forced in my face. Giving people what I have. Fuck that shit. Also, like that health bar is giant on the screen. Like it, like that takes up a pretty good portion of the screen. I feel like you could definitely minimize that shit. Hey, John the Baptist, I need a bath. I've been running all day and I've got some chafing going on and my private parts stank a little. Yeah. Who's next in line? Y'all were here before me. John's just out there standing in. A gator's gonna get you there, John. Like, uh, who's next? Are you next? You, uh, oh, he must be waiting on me. What's up, bro? The Messiah. Hey, don't. I don't know about all that now. I've just, uh, I've come here to get a bath. I have come to be baptized by you, John, and uh, make sure you stay away from my grundle area. I need to be baptized by you, and are you coming to me? Well, yeah, that's what I said. Permit it to be so now, for thus it is fitting for us to fulfill all righteousness. Who wrote this goddamn script? I mean, I know the creators of the game, but I mean, shit like this. I, I don't understand. Permit it to be so now for thus it is fitting for us to fulfill all righteousness. This feels like a mix. Like this is the first time we've used thus. Every, at every point before this point, 
it, it's been just like normal deadpan language and now we're getting for thus it is fitting for us to fulfill all righteousness like it just it seems a little weird bad fanfic definitely bad fanfic I have I have so much to say. Be it'll be like trolling. <laughs> Are there crocodiles in this river? Nah, the sharks ate all the crocodiles. I shall do as you say, Lord. Okay. Baptize me, you son of a bitch. I baptize you having authority from God as a demonstration of your commitment to his holiness. Oh, shit, here it is. It's the epiphany, guys. It's the epiphany of life. There it is! Like Fabio on that roller coaster. Hold to pray and gain spirit. Oh, give me that spirit. Mm, give me that spirit. Fuck, give me that spirit. Oh, yes. Oh, the spirit of God has come inside me. <laughs> that was that entire scene. It was just hold... <laughs> hold your mouse button down and gain spirit. <laughs> and a voice came from heaven. You are my son, whom I love. With you I am well pleased. And another loading screen. Like, <laughs> this has so many fucking loading screens. Oh my. <laughs> well, that took a second. <laughs> oh shit, John, there's a snake! It's right next to you! What the fuck are you doing? Get the fuck away from the snake, dude! What are your intentions now, Lord? Well, I figured I'd go and I'd twerk down at the uh, Dirty Kitty Cat uh, saloon there, or not saloon, but uh, bar. Yeah, you know, I mean, I think there are bars or something, and uh, I figured I'd just twerk down there, and then I'd probably go home and beat my meat a little bit. It is my calling to head into the Judean desert for 40 days and fast and subsist only on the Holy Spirit. Is it? Is it though? I see. I know many challenges lie ahead of you, but I know that the Holy Spirit now rests within you and shall serve as a guiding force for you, Lord. If there is ever any use you have for me, please let me know. Okay. Well, I, well he, he must have been communicating that psychically to me because his mouth did not move one bit. <laughs> you are the greatest man to have ever lived, John. You have already fulfilled great purpose. You are the greatest man to have ever lived, John, who has completed the greatest mission of any man. And another loading screen. What the fuck? <laughs> Chapter three. We already know about navigating the menus. Thank you. Look there. Now go away. Thank you. Luke four one. Jesus full of the Holy Spirit that came deep inside of him left the Jordan and was led by the spirit into the wilderness. <clears throat> okay. Chapter three, still, still no real game elements. Although there's a, there's a hint of game element. Jesus full of the Holy spirit 
left the Jordan and was led by the Spirit into the wilderness, where for 40 days he was tempted by the devil. We're not going to get tempted? We just get told about... That's the devil? Like... He ate nothing during those days, and at the end of them, he was hungry. I should hope it's 40 days without food. Like, what the fuck are you talking about? And another loading screen. We didn't even play anything at that point. It was just a cutscene. Come on, I want lasers coming out of my hands. I want to go translucent. <laughs> After 37 days of fasting and praying in the desert, Oh shit, I've gone fully fucking crazy now. Fasting of the Holy Spirit. You are starving and must head to each prayer location indicated by God's rays and pray in order to survive the desert. Oh shit, okay. We gotta go. We gotta go, we gotta pray in God's rays circle ring. Blessed are those who are spiritually needy. The kingdom of heaven belongs to them. Blessed are those who are sad. They will be comforted. Blessed are those who are humble. They will be given the earth. Pray. <clears throat> oh, beloved child of God, you must prepare for your trial ahead. You will be tempted and fall by the fallen one, Satan. Repel these blasts I throw at you. What? Do not worry. They cannot hurt you. What are you talking about? Repel the blast. What blast? Oh! Ow! I, I was repelling. Oh, that's the wrong one. Am I repelling the black? I can't tell if I'm repelling him. I'm, I'm using the key. Use that to repel blasts, okay. Oh, there we go. What the fuck? Okay, did one. Okay. Boom! <laughs> did it again! I gotta double click my mouse. Boom! It requires double clicking. Okay, it doesn't say that, but oh well. We'll get this shit figured out. Boom! Yeah, Jesus does have a deformed pinky. Yay, if we fail, it disproves God's omnipotence. GE, let's go. Feel the force around you. <laughs> It surrounds you. It binds you. Uh, no, uh, holding it down didn't do anything. Uh, it required double clicking, apparently. Blessed are those who show mercy. They will be shown mercy. Blessed are those whose hearts are pure. They will see God. Let's do it. If you notice, I was able to dodge your blasts with ease before. You must draw the enemy closer so they are unable to dodge your blasts. 
<laughs> my blasts. Hold that button in order to use a powerful energy wave to bring them closer. The wave will automatically lock on, but be alert to their movements and firing. Oh, the laser! <laughs> I don't remember this part of of the uh, the Bible though. Like I I I don't recall Jesus getting like these kinds of powers. Blessed are those who make peace. They will be called children of God. Blessed are those who suffer for doing what is right. The kingdom of heaven belongs to them. Um, During the battle, you may need to recharge. Pray and recharge so you are able to overcome any trials that lie ahead of you. Use the R key to recharge. That's the reload key. Yes. Recharge. Reload. <laughs> reload your Holy Spirit. <laughs> Shit, gotta reload my Holy Spirit slow. <clears throat> come on, Holy Spirit, come inside of me to recharge. <laughs> to recharge my shit. <sighs> so like why can't these rings be closer together if you're going to make me go to them? Like, this is just dead space now. Like, there's, there's no point. Like, what What do we gain from this as far as the game goes? It's, it's, I'm, I'm holding down a button. Blessed are you when people make fun of you and hurt you because of me. You are also blessed when they tell all kinds of evil lies about you because of me. Be joyful and glad. Your reward in heaven is great. In the same way, people hurt the prophets who lived long ago. <laughs> it's a short <laughs> refractory period, man. <laughs> all right, we're recharged and everything. Now, use all of this together before going ahead. So well, come here, you bitch! In order to repel three of my blasts and I forgot. Double click. Got it. Oh shit! I'm out of Holy Spirit energy. I reloaded. Come on now. <laughs> Booyah, ya fucking Oh gotta recharge And I can't I can't move Come here you Come here you bitch Recharge Free it Booyah, you dumbass! Come here, you holy light! Uh, oh shit! Come on! Booyah! Got it! Yeah, get the fuck out of here, you um, ominous light! Appar I, I apparently am unable to recharge right now. <laughs> Finish him! <laughs> the temptation of Christ is a biblical narrative detail to the Gospels of Matthew, Mark, and Luke.
You do know you don't have to go through all these trials, right? I can take care of everything you ever need or desire. Mm, that, that seems sexual. Come on. Why are you hurting yourself for 40 days? If you are the son of God, command this stone to become red. Red. See, it don't work. I don't know what the fuck you want from me. Join the dark side. We have croissant. If you worship me, it will be yours. Otherwise, I promise that this world will not be easy on you. Many trials will await you. I can alleviate you of all these trials if that is your wish. I can make you a king, rich, and supply you with anything you could possibly want. Talk about your angels to come and save you from all those trials. Or are you too afraid to do that? Satan's cocky. What's up, Satan? Why? Tell me only why you want to save all those humans. You don't deserve that and be I am being a heathen. Satan's just a big ball of fire right now, and he's trying to seduce me with whores and profitable businessmen. <laughs> no, he doesn't know Jesus at all. We don't have to do this the hard way. But if you insist. <laughs> Whoa! I get to repel Satan! Fuck you, Satan! Get back here, you bitch! Whoa! Ah, recharge! There, here's the... Here's the gameplay aspect of it that I was wanting! Recharge, and then... Oh! Deflect! Boom! Gonna recharge and then you gotta... Oh fuck! I missed! Shit! Give it! Booyah you fucking dipshit! Oh! I gotta recharge! Oh! Ow! Oh, he hit me! Ah! Uh, come here Satan! Ow! Ow! Oh, shit! Ow! The Satan! You dumb son of a bitch! Ow! I I will suffer this fucking game. Oh, I gotta recharge my Holy Spirit. No, like uh, I just uh, I gotta hit the the reload button. Eat your heart out, Tony Stark! Ow! I am defeated! Try again. Oh, you get to resurrect. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> I get to resurrect. <laughs> Here's the table on the toes one. I gotta fight Satan in the desert. I did it! What? Well, no, I mean like... Ah, uh, come here. Ah, oh, fuck. No. Oh, you dumb bastard! Come on! I was doing the thing, I was pointing at the deal. I even clicked that time and he didn't even fire! Son of a bitch! Y'all are seeing me... Y'all are seeing me... And it's supposed to deflect it, but it's not deflecting it. Like, this is bullshit. I'm not gonna let Satan defeat me in the desert. This is Mark 1 shit, okay? Apparently, there's just the right time.
try again, just like in the book. Got to keep resurrecting. <laughs> Maybe this is the prologue. It gets me through. This is the hardest part of the prologue because it doesn't fucking work like it should. Down, up, down, left, right, and ten hail Mary says the chick code. Okay. <laughs> okay. I don't, I don't understand. There we go. Get back here, Satan! Get your ass back here, you lord of darkness. There's, there's, I don't know how to consistently repel those fucking blasts because I'm pointing at the motherfuckers and it's like, it, it has to be the exact right point in order for the motherfucker to deflect. Like I didn't give any, they didn't give any kind of good indication. It's just like repel it with your hand. And it's like, there, there's not enough information to know when you're supposed to fucking repel it. Cause if you do it too soon, it gets passed. Do it too, you up in time. Like this is some fucking bullshit right here. You need to work on your gameplay elements over in the fuck develop this dumbass fucking game. Boom. <laughs> Sounds like the Bible, not enough information. Well, if I wait a couple of seconds longer before I do it, then it just gets past me because I don't have time to end up until it stop. Just stop. Okay, 
Come on, Sam. It, I feel like this is impossible right here. It's not impossible, I just suck. <laughs> For the rest of the adventures. I'm <laughs> 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 Boom! Got it! The literal Dark Souls. <laughs> Same stuff. I'll put all the credit on me. <laughs> okay. I'm trying to figure out when to do it, and I just can't. Boom. Is it like when it gets like kind of close to me? Boom. Okay. Boom. There it goes. I think I finally got, you gotta wait until just before it hits you. <laughs> like this is, this is ridiculous shit. Okay. So you gotta wait until it just before it hits you in order to fuck it up. Yeah. Fuck you, Satan. And your shit. No, no, get back here, pretty boy. Boom. Let's get back. Get, come on. Fuck, I gotta recharge. Gotcha. Come here. I'm wrangling you. 
Fuck! I gotta recharge my shit. Boom. Aha! You're a bitch, Satan! I've unlocked the power of Jesus Christ now! Fuck! What are you doing, Satan? You're changing the game on me. Fuck you. Ah, fuck you, Satan. Yes. <laughs> All right, you win this time. But I know that my opportunity shall arise again. And I will come again. You will not stop me in this world to take humans' souls. As I said, people who you love will betray you and kill you. I will wait for my time to come. <laughs> I will come again and again and again. You cannot stop me from coming. <laughs> He won this time, but this will not stop me. I will go everywhere in this land. I will go into every city, into every corner of them. I will take my power and spread my darkness everywhere. To all homes, to every human, every soul. I will enter their bodies and put my diseases inside. You. I will boil their minds and put my demon servants inside them. And then, I will go to Jerusalem, to their capital, and will tempt all citizens with my darkness and sins. In such a way, they will stop Jesus and kill him. Ha 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 ha! He can't stop me! <laughs> right, he can't stop me! <laughs> Oh, now we're on to chapter four. I figured it would end. Look at that. That seemed like a good like ending for the prologue here. Uh, you wouldn't be such a heathen if you just let the Lord come inside you. Come on, G. Just the tip. <laughs> and your little dog, too. <laughs> what, Satan is pulling a Dr. Claw? I'll get you next time, Jesus. Next time. As Jesus walked beside the Sea of Galilee, he saw Simon and his brother Andrew casting the net visually. Come, follow me, Jesus said, and I will send you out to fish for people. Okay, we'll go fish for people. What are we doing? Set up a slave trade? What are we doing there, Jesus? Go burn them! This fishing village, established during the time of the Has uh, Hasmonians, located on the northern shore of the Sea of Galilee. The town is cited in all four Gospels, where it is reported to have been in the town of Matthew, and it did not far from Bethsaida. The town of the Apostle Simon, Peter, Andrew, James, and John. It is considered the first church in the world, and believed it would be the place where the house of the Apostle was. Interesting. Now, now that you defeated Satan, he has spread his sins and dark energy throughout the land. You must enter into these dark areas and destroy his dark forces in order to proceed. Destroy the dark gems and pray in order to proceed. So, so Satan has infested the land with um, his darkness that are encapsulated in crystals that we now have to go and destroy, and then we have to pray after we destroy the crystals. The fuck? <laughs> Let's go and destroy some new age shit. Come on, I'm translucent, motherfuckers! Oh, okay, that... Alright. Oh, apparently, now I don't have to recharge. Ah, fuck you, New Agers! And your crystals! Fuck you, Satan, with your New Age crystal shit! We gotta be right up on the crystal to destroy it! 
claiming territory and locating objectives. You can claim a territory as well as locate your next objective by pressing the Z button. I have claimed this land. I have teabagged it. And it is now mine. This whole land is mine. You can open up your map, view all the objectives. What the fuck is going on over there? That ain't natural. Like, what the shit is that? Somebody is pulsing hard over there. Oh, wow. Okay. Oh, I can just move up and, like, I can't move left or right on the map. It's just sort of an up and down motion, apparently. We're in Magdala, where all the hills are. Why does this look like a Lord of the Rings map? <laughs> Help the fisherman. Okay. I gotta go into the swirly, like, distortion of reality? Okay, can I... I can't recharge right now, so I can't reload my guns. Oh, it's a prayer ring! And that's it. You have to pee in the territory first before you claim it. <laughs> Unlocking new abilities? Like, Jesus had unlocked new abilities? What the fuck is this? Approach the pressure plate. Okay. Stairway to heaven. Wait, what? Here, uh, the pressure plate requires something to be placed on it. Press Q in order to spawn an object to weigh it down. Where was this power in the Bible? <laughs> I can spawn an object to create a stairway to heaven. <laughs> you can hold physics items. What the fuck is a physics item? It's in this. Oh. Push in cool objects. Pull the bridge closer to you and release your hold. The fuck? Interaction. <laughs> Not the new ability. You can interact with the world around you. That's a, a new ability. And Jesus said with disciples, now I have a machine gun. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, what? Interesting, I brought up the, the dev thing. Uh, yeah, I don't know, for some reason my, my, um, my stuff dropped down pretty low. I don't know what's going on. Uh, my stream health says, Eric, you're not seeing enough of the go or some shit. Looks like it's, it's, it was getting on back up there. Testing one, two. Okay, I think we're back. Uh, for for whatever reason, it it like um it got weird. I don't know what's good. I don't know what is going on with that. Okay. Start a new stream. Yes. <laughs> uh, I think that, uh, I think we're back. Let's see, we gotta go over here and I guess maybe there's some bushes we gotta pee on or something. Like, this is a lot of game for the, uh, prologue. I tell you, do not worry. Don't worry about your life and what you will eat or drink. And don't worry about your body and what you will wear. Isn't there more to life? Fuck this than house! Things? Aren't there more important things for the body than clothes? Look at the birds of the air. They don't plant or gather crops. They don't put away crops in storerooms. Can I help you? But your father, who is what are you doing over here? Them, aren't you worth much more than they are? Can you add even one? I'm Simon. To your this life? is my brother I'm Andrew in the boat. We're trying to catch fish. We haven't been able to catch much for days. Times are bad for fishermen in these areas. 
The time is bad to be a fisherman, but the time is right to be a fisher of men. Of the men folk. Fisher, fisher of, of men? Men? Yeah, so fuck these fish. They're stubborn as shit. And just how do you do that? We struggle even to catch fish. We haven't caught anything all day. Lock the new ability. Press the tab button to select the interaction ability to test it. Okay. Can guide. We're guiding fish. Hold the left mouse button for five seconds, then hold the right for five seconds. After this, guide the fish towards the boat. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Go there. Oh, okay, so, uh... There we go. Did it. Easy. Eating as easy as herding cats. So you're more important than the fishing of fish. Your power is amazing. I shall follow you, Lord, since I have seen your miraculous power. You helped me catch fish, therefore I'm going to follow you as God. You will follow me now. Do my bidding. Hold my pocket. <laughs> Head out of the area. Okay. Come on, Simon and Peter. Fuck these fishes. Yay! Have you have you ever gutted and cleaned a man, Timmy? Fuck, chapter five. This is a lot of Jesus shit. <laughs> Drop it like it's hot, Peter. <laughs> JT, <laughs> here, fishy, 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 fishy. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta get them catfish. Oh shit! They're being attacked by Satan! Back the Satan with your new age crystal shit! Get back behind the Satan! Your new age crystals can't heal shit, Satan! I am going to claim this land by peeing and teabagging on it! Oh. I peed on it. What 
is in front of my face. Okay. Oh, I wasn't uh, far enough into the prayer location. I got it. <laughs> Wait, those crystals are uh, di uh, dilithium. Di they're dilithium crystals. Got it. <laughs> Uh-oh, pressure plates continue. Let's see. Let's... You can launch boxes and hit targets. Grab an object using that, then pressing that without releasing. Spawn a box using Q on the ground. Yes. Boom! Oh, fuck yes! Ah! Oh, that goes pretty far. That's pretty powerful right there. Got it. Oh, now I gotta do two. Like, like there's no way to aim this shit. <laughs> I, have, I have no idea. Fuck. Almost got it that time. <laughs> Fuck, it went too far that time. <laughs> Come on, Jesus. Just fucking <laughs> work with the physics here. Okay, there we go. Got it. Shit, now there's five of them. Uh, something's not working over here on my setup anyways all right I'm a master now fuck <laughs> got it Honey, did you know Jesus could spawn random ass boxes? I don't think so. He just manifests them. The amount of loading screens in this game is way too damn high. If this is what the actual game is going to be like, I just don't even want to, just don't even want to do it. Like, why? <laughs> the fuck? I mean, to be quite honest, that's what the world feels like whenever I get up in the morning. It's like, I just don't even know, like, what the fuck am I looking at? Geometric shapes? Oh, shit. <laughs> uh, 
I mean, we're on chapter five. We've collected some fishers of men, and now we're about to do maybe an orgy. I'm not sure. This is a I know. Water to wine. I gotta go talk to Simon and turn some water into wine. Let's get our drink on. judge other people, then you will not be judged. If you do not find others guilty, then you will not be found guilty. Forgive, and you will be forgiven. Give, and it will be given to you. Say, okay, this is what breaks the immersion for me in this Jesus narrative here, is that there's all this ambiance noise, but nobody's doing anything. They're all standing there deadpan. Like, this motherfucker isn't even drinking. Like, he's just holding a cup with some wine in it. Oh, there, now he's drinking. Okay. No, but um, in, in the previous market, everybody was just sort of standing around not doing anything. Also, I can see through the character model. Y'all are just going to be right on my ass the entire time? Okay. Oh, I got to talk to Simon. Which one's Simon? It looks yeah. like the wedding is up ahead. We're in the wedding, motherfucker! What are you talking about? Indeed, it does. Is this Mama? That looks like Mama. Hello, yep. Jesus. I haven't seen you in so long. I'm glad you could make it. I'm afraid the wedding appears to have a small issue. There's a man who appears to be in need of assistance. I'm not sure what to do. I don't know. Let's go see this man. Come on. You gotta make some wine. G give me the pots. I'm just gonna do the pots and the wine. How fucking long is this prologue? Does it get us up to the crucifixion? Like, what the fuck are we doing? Thanks, I'll talk to him. Yes, I will, t I will talk to him, Mom. Thank you. What's your problem? Oh. We've run out of wine. Move the jars to the stage, you dumb son of a bitch! I'll take care of it, you fucker. And loading screen. Oh, no. Okay. Enter the Holy Spirit mode by pressing tab. And select the interaction, maybe? First by pressing that and then holding that while in front of the jar of wine, do it three times in order to complete the miracle. Boom! Fucking wine! Look at that, bitch! Okay, so you gotta enchant the object first and then you can work your magic on it. It seems weird that I don't need like more prayer shit. Like, may, like I feel like I should have to pray before I do this. Like, please God, allow me to turn this water into wine because people are really expecting a pretty good trick to do for this, this wedding. I mean, it would be great if I could get them drunk. That way my jokes will make sense later. And done. I am Jesus Christ. Where are you guys looking at me? Uh, do I say go? 
Do as I say, go and taste the water. I don't understand what this has to do with anything, but I'll do what you say. Go do it. Y'all couldn't animate him like going and drinking the wine? How's it taste, bitch? This is This wine tastes better than the wine we had before. That's because it's my blood. <laughs> Seriously, why are you, why is your face in the door? Jesus, I want you to meet the groom. Hello, I'm glad you could make it. I'm a bit embarrassed too. Jesus managed to get us wine. Let's go and try it. It's the best wine I've ever had. Well, I'll be the judge of that. Let's go try it. <laughs> well, I'll be the judge. <laughs> that was the most uninteresting in <laughs> like, voiceover for this. And then he turns back around and puts his face in the door. Awesome. What you think of my blood, B? This one is amazing. What did you do to make it so good? I bled in it. Thank Chapter 6 Once more he visited Cana in Galilee, where he had turned the water into wine. And there was a certain royal official whose son lay sick at Capernaum. When this man heard that Jesus had arrived in Galilee from Judea, he went to him and begged him to come and heal his son, who was close to death. Unless you people see signs and wonders, Jesus told him, you will never believe. The royal official said, Sir, come down before my child dies. Go, Jesus replied, your son will live. The man took Jesus at his word and departed. I guess since we're going to be making that pasta, I need to get to work on this Italian, huh? The, 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 it's in there. Oh, okay. Okay. Nice. This guy's got some mascara on. I know I am unworthy to have such a request, but I know anything is possible, and I believe that yeah. you can heal me. Well, he's Roman. Please. <laughs> I like how Jesus was like, what? Tab, and then heal ability. Oh, shit. Can clear viruses. What? I'm inside this little kid's body. Got to clear the virus. Oh my God! It's COVID nineteen. It's COVID, honey. It's I'm gonna defeat COVID nineteen. 
Fuck you, COVID. Boom, I'm burning it out of this little child. It's exactly how the human body works right here. I'm in his blood vessels. I did not uh, expect the blood vessels to be a thing. Is there is there a map? No. Nope. <coughs> I apparently gotta just keep going down this blood vessel here. Also, why am I hearing birds and shit? No. I also don't know how to get... Oh, wait, there it is. Fuck you, COVID! I'm healing you with the power of Jesus! There's the other one. Fully heal the body by pressing that as well as that at the same time. Why didn't I do that before? I heal this boy with my translucent hands. You're fine. Get up, you little shit. Return to your son. Thank you. Yes, Lord. <laughs> Could you back up? I have some personal space, <laughs> Lord. Yes, Lord. Got a, a lot of bunch of dialogue. Got it. And back to a loading screen. I feel like half of this game is just waiting for it to load. Jesus must be. While he was Papa. still on the way, his servants <laughs> met him with the news that his boy was living. When he inquired as to the time when his son got better, they said to him, Yesterday, at one in the afternoon, the fever left him. Then the father realized that this was the exact time at which Jesus had said to him, Your son will live. So he and his whole household believed. This was the second sign Jesus performed after coming from Judea to Galilee. Is that it? Please tell me that's all because this is two hours of a 10 hour game. Oh no. Line three. We got, we got an issue. And it crashed. <laughs> I mean, that's all that I got time for today, it, but it, it, I don't know what happened. It crashed. I don't know if it's going to, I don't know if it was saving progress while we were going about it, but, um, you know, I'll let you guys know, uh, failed color. Yeah. Uh, I don't know why they would put it on steam with, uh, you know, well, I mean, there have been, uh, games to release with pretty bad breaking stuff. Uh, anyways, the game not saving. 
Let's see. It was fun hanging out with you. Godless heathens. Yeah. Thanks everybody for joining today. Uh, that, uh, stopped by. I really appreciate y'all, uh, stopping by for it. Um, and, uh, I guess we'll see you guys maybe tonight. I don't know if we're going to have, uh, uh, carrier on for it, but I guess we'll find out. So, uh, y'all have a nice day, night, whatever. And, uh, maybe we'll see you heathens later. Uh, don't forget to stand up, use your voice and all that kind of good shit. Okay. Bye heathens.